When a man is a soldier, he knows what is at risk. But when a man is a football player, he does not know that he can lose his mind, his family, his life. By dying, they speak for the living, and I speak for them. Bennett's story was almost like breathing oxygenated air. It was pure, it was uncomplicated, it was heroic, it was patriotic. Bennett is from a tiny little town in Nigeria, and he was the sixth of seven children, and then he used medical school as a chip to get out of Nigeria. He never wanted anything more than to be accepted as an American. There's this great scene in the movie where he goes, heaven's here and America's here. To me, it was the place where God sent all of his favorite people. Americans were the manifestation of what God wanted us all to be. I took that line right out of Bennett's mouth. My father teased me I was a professional student. The last time I counted, I had like eight degrees and certifications. It isn't until he starts working with dead bodies that he finds his calling. My specialty is the science of death. I think more about why people die than I do the, the way people live. He has a wonderful sixth sense about trying to figure out how a person died. He delivers that information to the family and he considers himself to be a helper for the deceased and for the family to move to the next phase. My faith teaches us that when you die, your spirit and your soul progress to eternal life. He's a deeply spiritual man, and when he's performing an autopsy, it's a spiritual experience for him. I did not know anything really about food. I didn't even know what a quarterback was. My objective was to embrace the truth. He didn't care what he was going to lose, what he had to give up to bring this truth forward. And he really, really helped these families understand what happened to their loved ones. You definitely thank him. He had this disease because I want to believe that. I believe so, yes. His desire was merely to just be a citizen, tell the truth, do his job well, contribute to society. And these were very simple, very American concepts. The story of an immigrant who came to America, suffered what he had to suffer, and ultimately was vindicated. I never wanted this to be about me but about the players. This is about love and light. Let us save lives and enhance the lives of other people. Because I had promised Mike Webster, we would set you free. You were a victim. If you continue to deny my work, your men continue to die. Their families left in ruins. Tell the truth. Tell the truth.